Tommy Moore is the oceanographer for the Northwest Indian Fisheries Commission, which supports tribes in Washington state. He says in recent years, repeated heat waves off the coast there have damaged salmon and crab stocks. I know it is a concern because it's tough to maintain a fishery when and maintain your way of life when it becomes increasingly uncertain. A way of life because, in addition to economic benefits, many Native communities are culturally tied to specific marine animals. Worldwide, indigenous communities are disproportionately affected by climate change. Moore says a side effect of being intimately involved in the ocean is that tribes have a lot of knowledge to offer scientists and policymakers. The fishermen are... You know, they've been out there working these areas for uh, generations, and they see changes that um, scientists wouldn't see. Today's report stresses the importance of that knowledge as countries adapt to warming oceans. Because while eliminating greenhouse gas emissions immediately would help lessen the impacts on the oceans in the long term, there is no way out in the short term. The oceans will keep getting hotter and higher, and it will require dramatic, sometimes painful changes to how people live along the world's coast. (laughs) 